Hello, everybody. My name is Ron Sor, and welcome back to WWE 2K22. Now, we are going into a hell in a cell match against The Undertaker. The Undertaker. The freaking Undertaker. We're going against The Undertaker. I'm scared. We're going against Undertaker in a hell in a cell match. If you did not see last video, you should probably check it out because it kind of explains what the storyline this is the end of the storyline against kane and the undertaker but you'll find out what happens at that storyline so go check out last video and yeah let's get into it i'm ready charles let's go my boy charles yes charles is ready charles is determined to win i turned on my mic a bit so it might be a little quiet but you guys can turn up you got phones or if you're watching this on your computer but Look how much taller he is than Charles. Charles will take him down. Charles with the beautiful Hurricane Ronda to start the match. Now kick to the face. He's going down instantly. He's not like any other big men. And now a DDT right to his face. And then a Moon Salt. Man, Undertaker is taking some big damage. Ooh my, Undertaker. I'm going to throw Undertaker off the cell. But first, let's get a weapon. Let's get a weapon. The first weapon, I'm getting a chair. Give me the chair. We're get, I'm getting the chair. I'm getting the ring. Get in the ring, Undertaker. Come on. Come on, Undertaker. Boom! They made the chair animation faster, which was smart, because that chair animation was slow as frick. Oh, DDT on the chair? DDT on the chair! Oh, I mean, that probably didn't do much damage. I mean, do, do a different amount of damage, but Jesus, that looked painful. The oh, he countered. Oh, he's gonna throw me. Oh, right through the cell! Oh, no, right through the cell. Get up. Get up, me. Come on, get up, me. I can't tell if I'm getting up because of the crowd. Crowd, stop going crazy. Oh, big punch. Boom. I'm climbing. Let's do it. Let's climb. Both me and Undertaker are climbing to the top of hell in a cell. Me and Undertaker. Oh my goodness. We're both on top of the cell. Signature on top of the cell. Oh my goodness. Right on top of the hell in a cell structure. It's right, Undertaker. Ugh. Punch. Oh no. Ow. Yep. Ugh. Alright, get over here, Undertaker. I'm sick of you. Let's do it. Go over. Oh my god! <laughs> He's dead. He's gotta be dead. I just threw him. Off the hell in a cell. I'm going to dive. Oh! <laughs> oh. He's gotta be dead. Oh. Right through the announcer's table. He's dead. Alright, yep, Undertaker, meet me in the ring. I just threw you off the Hell in a Cell structure, and you're still walking. That's kind of impressive, to be honest. But, oh, I missed the Fisty Cuffs. Doesn't matter, I'll do them again. Fisty Cuffs to the Undertaker. The Undertaker's first experience with the Fisty Cuffs, and boom! Big Fisty Cuffs cover! Cover, he's gotta be dead. I threw him off a of Hell in a Cell and gave him Fisty Cuffs. What? Oh my god, he's definitely dead. I mean, he is the Undertaker. That kind of makes sense he's alive, but... What? Oh, but he's already dead. You can't kill something that's already dead. He is the Undertaker. I can't... I'm gonna hit him with the signature move first, just to make sure he's dead. Oh, he met. Oh, he countered. Yep, yep. Boom! Kick to the face. Oh! What? Oh, he's back! Oh, frick! Oh, he did the blackout. It didn't matter. Didn't matter. Ow! Big punch! He's got a finisher. Oh no, he's got a finisher. He blacked out. He did the blackout. But, here we go. Fisty Cuffs. The second Fisty Cuffs. He caught him out of nowhere. He did not expect the Fisty Cuffs right there. Boom! That's gotta be it. Fisty Cuffs number two. After throwing him off the cell as well. Two. Three. We get the win. Charles defeats The Undertaker. In a hell in a cell match. We completed. We completed the storyline with Mayor Kane. Now let's see if there's any more online stuff. I'm gonna keep doing B Day to the Goat. Maybe someday. 
Happy birthday. How dare you wish someone's happy birthday? Have B days to the GOAT. Maybe someday I'll be on your level. Don't think that'll ever happen. You'll never be on the level of Rey Mysterio. But keep telling yourself that. You're all talk and no action. I back up my words in the ring. Really? I hardly ever noticed you. Did you wear a mask before you came to WWE? Maybe it's time to put it back on. <laughs> Maybe you can get some attention. Plus, it saves everyone from seeing your ugly face. Oh, Jesus. Charles. Man. My mask was about luchador pride, not hiding. But maybe you take your own idea. Wouldn't mind never having to look at you again. Sorry, get used to seeing this face on all main event posters and promos. That's right, Charles. We'll be on everything. How about you and I have a reverse mask match? We face off, and then the loser, that will be you, has to wear a mask of the winner's choice for 30 days? I already have the perfect mask in mind for you. Unless you're chicken. Hmm... Chicken, eh? I wonder if he's gonna give me a chicken mask. <laughs> it seems like a real chicken is the guy who has to name drop other superstars just to get attention. But if it means covering up that eye story, you call a face for a month and you're on. This sounds interesting. I'll make it happen. So, making the mask issue. So, a mystery award. So, I have to wear a mask if I win. And the mystery awards, I have a feeling... I've just got a feeling of what it is, but no objectives in this match. Yep. Oof. Ooh, yeah. All right. Do it. Moonsault. Let's go. Weird cannonball. Frick, I missed. <laughs> ah, ooh, wow. Big. Whoa, what the frick? I didn't expect that. Cool move. Cool move, buddy. Ow. Ah, this guy's beating me up. Boom! Big move there, and now the DDT. Boom! Ow, he reversed. This guy's tougher than The Undertaker. No offense to The Undertaker. Actually, that's a lot of offense to The Undertaker. So far, this guy's been beating me up more than The Undertaker. The Undertaker wasn't giving me that much of a fight. I threw—I mean, I threw him off the hell in a cell. <laughs> I'm still going to talk about that, because Jesus, that was... Yeah, just, I just threw him off. <laughs> Signature. Boom! Hit him with it, hit him with it, hit him with it, hit him with it. Pit him, hit him. End the match now. Just end it. One, two. He kicked out. Get, get out of my way, ref. I gotta see this match going on. Fisty cuff time. Time for the fisty cuffs. The fisty cuffs. The classic finisher. Boom. No one can copy the fisty cuffs like Charles. That should be it. One, two. Oh, he kicked out. People have been kicking out of the fisticuffs. Well, it makes... Oh, sure. All right. There we go. The signature move. Boom, baby. This is it. The signature. This is it. Fisticuffs time. Fisticuffs time. It's time for the fisticuffs. All right. Here we go. Do the little dance. Do the little dance. Boom. This has got to be it. No one kicks out of two fisticuffs. One. Two. Three. All right. Now he has to wear a mask. All right. Omri wanted a reverse mask match, and I wanted you to save the WWE Universe of seeing his stupid face. You're welcome, at WWE. Talk your own Charles mask or mask, I'll still beat you in a ring. You're still claiming that after our last match, the one you just lost? Wow, stupid and ugly. Not a great combination. Man, I am just... This poor guy, I'm bullying him. Keep adding fuel to my fire. I'll wear the mask. A deal's a deal. But meet me in the ring for a ring match. See if you get lucky twice. Why not? Happy to add another W to my record. Can't wait to see how you look and what I picked out. Hashtag Polo. What did I pick out for this man? Disc. What is the mask? What did I pick out? What did I pick out for the mask? What is it? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. <laughs> I made him put on a chicken suit. Oh my god. I picked out a chicken suit. <laughs> I literally picked out a chicken costume for... Dorado, oh my, I had to embarrass him that bad. So, Charles is facing a chicken. <laughs> a man in a chicken costume. This Carreo guy, I made him wear a chicken suit. <laughs> Just to embarrass him as much as physically possible, I made him wear a chicken suit. This poor man. 
I kind of feel bad, but I don't. Charles, it's kind of funny. Charles, that's what he gets. That's what he gets for trash talking me. That's what he gets for existing on WWE television. He shouldn't exist. That's what he gets. The wet nap. Oh, come on! It wasn't even that far away, Charles. Come on, Charles. You can't be messing up like that. All right, costume for this man. All right, stun. Urgh, let's go, baby. He, this poor man. I, I've embarrassed him by beating him. Embarrassed him by putting a chicken costume on him, and and also embarrassed him by beating him up senseless. All right, signature, right to the chicken. Signature to the chicken. Signature to the chicken. That's it. The finisher has all I have to do is hit it. The Fisty, no, he countered the fisty cuffs. Oh, no, that's not good. He's going, oh, no, he's not going for raw big power bomb. Now, the fisty cuffs right to the chicken's face. Embarrass him even more, Charles. Boom, right to the chicken. Let's go. One, two, three. We beat the chicken. That poor man, we already embarrassed him by putting him in a chicken costume. But now we beat him. That's two wins in a row, chicken man. <laughs> Hope you get to experience that feeling someday, Umbrio. At least you finally look good losing. Really liked my new look, cousin. Yes, I had thought of it years ago. My eyes, thank you, Charles. Not to mention the mask may be a little harder to hear, which is also fantastic. Funny, Angel Garza, we may be a family, but we won't stop us from shutting you up. Really? Okay, and I'd love to see that polo mask in action again. Hey, Charles, feels like making it three on three against my cousin? It would be my pleasure. Better find a partner, Umbrio. Third time's the charm, right? All right. Third time's the charm to beat him after I beat him, chicken man. <laughs> beat the chicken man, but we'll leave that for next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. This is a fun video. Throwing Undertaker off a hell in a cell? Putting a guy in a chicken costume just to embarrass him? That's the Charles way right there. We actually have some upgrades, but I'm going to do that while we're talking. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all the support. I've gotten a lot of support on my videos lately, and I really thank you guys for that. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!